my good friend Scott Myers. Welcome to the podcast. Hey, Jay. It is a good to see you again, my friend. How are you? I am doing fantastic. I know we've got a mastermind meeting coming up pretty soon out there mm -hmm. in Scottsdale. Are you yep. going to make that one or you don't know yet? Uh, I am uh, looking forward to it and I will attend any and all of those that will be held in uh, Arizona because now I have uh, two kiddos that are going to Grand Canyon University in Phoenix. And so uh, we're going to be spending a lot of time out in Arizona. <laughs> oh, that's great. Well, Carol Joy and I, we've mm -hmm. already got our plane tickets. We've got our hotel reservations. So I look forward to seeing you in Scottsdale in just a few short weeks right around the corner. Likewise. Can't wait. Absolutely. Well, Scott, uh, as I told everybody mm -hmm. in the introduction, I mean, your expertise, your wheelhouse is self-storage and self-storage facilities. Um, mm -hmm. But before we get into mm -hmm. that world and your arena, uh, first of all, just tell everybody how you got into real estate. Yeah. Wow. I, I think probably like most people out there, started with a single family house and uh, I learned from, and many folks uh, on here will recognize this name and a whole lot won't, uh, Carlton Sheets, um, who was uh, one of the grandfathers uh, along with uh, Ron Legrand and some of the others that taught people how to get into real estate. So I followed his program uh, to buy houses, rehab them, refinance them, rent them out, and then uh, replicate and do that over and over again. So the Burr method before it was called the Burr method. And so that's how we got started. I uh, bought a single family house. Um, this was back in 1993 was the, the first one that I ever bought. It had an assumable VA mortgage on it, which I don't think there's any of those left out there any longer and allowed me to get in and just assume that mortgage with a uh, very little experience um, in the way of e even credit history at the time. I was a pretty young guy at the time, uh, as you can tell by uh, my age now and doing the math. So uh, that's how it started. And then we moved on to buying up more. We, we refinanced, bought two more houses. Then we'd uh, fix them up, refinance and buy more. So we had about 75, I think 76 houses and um, didn't really have the cash flow and the the you know, the freedom that we wanted that Carlton Sheets had mentioned in the home study system. So we thought, well, economies of scale, we'll fix this. So we started getting into apartments and buying um, uh, several complexes around central Indiana. Uh, but same thing, it just kind of bought us more tenants, toilets, trash, headaches, and uh, the business model just wasn't right for us. We wanted to have time. We wanted the the, the freedom that real estate brings. And so and to do that in real estate, that means no tenants, no toilets. So that's either parking lots or self-storage. And you can't really build a lot of value in, in parking lots uh, that we found. But once I dug into self-storage, I realized that ah, this is this is the place I need to be. Uh, people don't pay rent. You lock them out and you sell their stuff off and get paid. Um, you turn it around by taking a, a blower and you blow the unit out. No paint, no carpet, no extensive clean out or repairs. And once I more the more I looked into the business, I, I really saw the light and decided that um, this is the path I wanted to take. So sold our houses, our apartments, and now we've gone just 100% uh, into self storage. Made that transition about 2005 to where we are now today, uh, which is uh, where you mentioned Jay. We uh, we buy existing facilities still. That same model is in place. We also convert industrial buildings, grocery stores, anything that is uh, can be repurposed into self-storage. We'll buy it and convert it. And then we build from the ground up. And we do a lot of this uh, by partnering and doing joint ventures and then uh, syndicating the private equity, uh, which is where you come in, Jay. And uh, you know uh, all too well what that looks like and, and how we can leverage other people's money um, and bring them along as limited partners to enjoy in the growth and this incredible business. So Hope that wasn't longer than what you were looking for, but that's that's my story.